It's another lovely acronym. Um, and this one also means to greet or acclaim enthusiastically, which is quite nice. So as in hail Caesar. Um, the H stands for honesty. And by honesty, I mean being clear and straight in what you say, not obfuscating, not using huge words where small ones will do, uh, ideally not using jargon, not trying to impress people by confusing them. Um, so being clear and straight in what you say. As I said earlier, it may need to be tempered. I'm not talking about being absolutely honest all the time, like a um, was it in Stranger in a Strange Land by Robert Heinlein? I think uh, he had a, a person who was a truth sayer who had to say the absolute truth at all times mm. and only the truth. Well, not necessarily that far. But being clear and straight all the time is a great direction to point in, you know, and these things are not all, um, yeah, they're, they're not an impeccable standard. I'm not talking about perfectionism across all of these things. I'm talking about pointing in this direction, having this intention, and it will help a great deal. The A of Hale is authenticity. And that is to say, being yourself. It's a lot more difficult to try and be somebody else a lot of the time. We all have a tendency to be a bit chameleon-like. I mean, you won't necessarily use the same language with your grandparents as you would with your young friends. Uh, you might speak in different ways. You know, there might be profanity in one place with the grandparents, but not with the young friends. You know, uh, all sorts of things can change. Um, but as long as you're being authentically you, you know, we have different aspects to our character. That's how we are as human beings. We are complex and multifaceted, but not pretending to be somebody else. And that's much more difficult to carry. Um, and, uh, you know, on stage, you can generally see if somebody's doing that, uh, not generating themselves, but trying to be somebody else. Unless you